Hey what's up YouTube, Proxman here. Today I'll be doing a video about gifts for men for the upcoming holiday season. Someone asked me in YouTube if I could come up with several items that I could recommend as gifts for their loved ones. So what I did was gather several items as part of my personal collection and picked what I believe would be great items as gifts for this holiday season. My goal is to give you some ideas that doesn't break the bank and hopefully saves you some money for this uh, holiday season. Of course, there are millions of ideas out there. I believe the best gifts are those items that are usable to the person you are giving it to as part of their daily lives. So let's get on with it. And the first one on my list is a toiletries travel pouch. I would say it is one of the most underrated items that any man out there should have. It's very versatile, which allows you to store your toiletries, such as your razor, deodorant and other items that you might need for your personal hygiene. I recommend having at least two of these pouches especially for traveling. One for your checked in luggage and the other one as part of your hand carry bag which I normally put a toothbrush, deodorant and a small tube of toothpaste. And this pouch here would normally cost about 10 bucks and I got this from Walmart which is pretty amazing because it has a lot of uh, compartments. Perfect for sorting out your personal hygiene kit. So again, this is about 10 bucks. Next one on my list is a razor from Gillette and the best one on their product line is the Fusion Pro Glide. I love these razors. They are very easy to use and only cost about 10 bucks from Walmart or Shoppers Drug Mart here in Canada. It comes with uh, two cartridges, as you can see here. It should last you about three months depending on usage. I used to use electric shaver, however, I deviated from them after I realized that the replacement blades on most electric shaver cost arm and a leg, which is pretty sad. Next one on my list here are a pair of tweezers, and you could never underestimate the importance of having a pair of tweezers, let alone a really good one. The next item I have here are your personal grooming kit for men, and this one here I got it from Amazon, I believe it's about $17, and it comes with multiple tools that you can possibly imagine. Uh, there are about three uh, nail clippers, uh, one for your toenail, uh, a couple of your fingernails, and there's just a bunch of things that comes with it. So again, for 17 bucks, you really can't go wrong with this. And I use this pretty much on a weekly basis, especially when I trim my fingernails, and they are just so usable. I haven't really ventured using a lot of these items, except for, I believe, this one here for um, popping pimples or cleaning buckets and so forth so again it comes with so many tools for 17 bucks definitely a good item to go for perfect for holiday season as a gift another one on my list would be men's personal hygiene care products and these include uh, many items such as your uh, facial cancer facial scrub facial moisturizer antiperspirant or deodorant and I would say I'm a big fan of um, Kiehl's product line and these are great by the way however for the set of facial scrub, facial cleanser and uh, facial moisturizer it will set you back for about a hundred bucks they are super effective and it feels good on the skin especially their facial scrub and facial moisturizer so these uh, three items here uh, if you are on a tight budget you might want to check out the L'Oreal men's product line. Uh, their facial scrub, which is this one here, uh, would cost you roughly about 10 bucks. And their facial moisturizer is about 12 bucks, 13 bucks, depends on where you buy it. So these two here are perfect. I usually have these two as my backup. They work really well and do the job in exfoliating and moisturizing your skin that doesn't leave any uh, sticky residue. And that's the reason why I have this on the go. I normally uh, put it inside my gym bag. It's an amazing product to have. If you want to stick with a specific brand, a lot of companies often sell one package of their men's personal hygiene product. And the one that I have here, I'd like to show you. Clear the table here for you. Would be the Dove um, Men's Plus Care product. Uh, for 25 bucks, it comes with several items inside. This package here will save you a lot of money. First of all, it comes with a toiletry pouch, 
uh, which is awesome by the way. Take this one. Comes with four bars of soap, an antiperspirant, a body wash and face wash in one bottle, shampoo, uh, with conditioner, and a body scrub or exfoliator. So as you can see here, we'll open it up for you. So that's the four bars of soap. That's your uh, exfoliator, your antiperspirant. And this is your body wash plus face wash and shampoo with conditioner. So all of these items, so one, two, three, four, five, six, basically for 25 bucks and it's a money saver. I love uh, Dove products for men. I have used them before. Uh, the only thing I am not a big fan of is their deodorant or antiperspirant. I have used them before. For some reason, I find that it leaves a stain or residue on my shirt. So, other than that, for 25 bucks, it definitely is a great money saver. Again, I bought this uh, whole package here from Shopper Stock Mart. Moving on, the next one I have here is a small travel kit bag from Walmart. If I can remember correctly, this travel kit cost me about 10 bucks and it comes with amazing stuff that is useful for someone who loves to travel. It comes with small bottle of mouthwash, uh, body wash, shampoo, a small toothbrush, and a pack of Kleenex. Also there is an empty bottle here which you can use it for whatever you need to use it for. So again for 10 bucks definitely doesn't break the bank and uh, for something like this it looks like it will qualify as a hand carry pouch but I would not risk it personally. I would stash this one inside my check-in luggage when I'm traveling. So again for 10 bucks Definitely a good idea to have or to give to someone. Up next, uh, we have here Arcalone for fragrances for men. So, now this is a little subjective in a sense that you must be sure as to what kind of scent that your man likes or prefer. Personally, for myself, I am a fan of uh, musky and also citrusy smell. It's always a safe bet to give a cologne that he normally wears, especially if the person is running low of that specific cologne. As for my list that I recommend, here are a few ones. Um, first one I have here is the Calvin Klein Eternity, one of the classic cologne for men. I mean, this cologne, I love this. <laughs> I lucked out of finding this one from Shopper Stock Market for about 20 bucks, and this is their anniversary edition. I grew up wearing this cologne, and it's still one of the best cologne out there for me. Another brand that I can recommend is the YSL brand. Their colognes for men are one of the best in the market. I love the Lana with the Loam uh, cologne along with the old time version. They are very musky smell and they just smell great. However, I find uh, YSL colognes tend to be for a specific uh, setting such as you know for nighttime or daytime uh, usage. Normally these bottles would cost you about 50 to 100 bucks depending, depending on where you buy it. I normally look at different stores and find if they are on sale. On the side note, you might want to consider uh, this cologne here uh, from Burberry, uh, Brit uh, Rhythm. This cologne is pretty cool because in a sense it gives that nice manly citrusy with a hint of a woody or aromatic smell. But at the same time it's not overpowering. Uh, this would probably run you about 40 bucks. Again, I got mine from Shopper Stock Mart for about 20 bucks. I just happened to stumble upon this cologne on the sale rack. So it was the last one actually so I just grabbed it. Next one on my list is definitely one of the classic. It's the Aqua di Gio by Giorgio Armani. And I'd say it's one of the best colognes out there as well. Uh, I find this cologne more of a summer scent with a nice crisp of citrusy smell, but not overpowering, which is something that you wanna uh, go for. I would also consider using this cologne as an everyday cologne, since the smell is subtle and very alluring actually. I bought this uh, gift set from the States for about uh, 40 bucks uh, US dollars. So this one here, it's amazing because it comes with a big bottle, 100 ml, and also comes with a uh, uh, body wash. So lastly on my list for colognes are for those in a solid budget. <laughs> this cologne here that I have is from uh, Zara. 
called Weekend Till 8 p.m. Definitely, uh, this cologne from Zara gained my respect for not breaking the bank while being awesome. This cologne offers a nice uh, musky and aromatic smell and only costs roughly about 20 bucks. Like, I often find this cologne sold out from the store. Uh, the silage of this cologne is amazing and when I apply it on my shirt, the smell lasts for several hours and I can still smell the scent on my clothes the next day. So if you're looking for a good cologne uh, for daily usage, this might be a perfect gift as a cologne for your man. Again, it's uh, from Zara called uh, Weekend Till 8 p.m. So the last few items on my video are men's accessories and it's one of the best ideas you can consider. In general, men love watches period, so here are a few watches that you might want to consider. I'm a big fan of dark rose gold color for watches along with watches with brown leather straps and one of the best brands out there that won't break the bank is Fossil. They make really nice watches that are affordable and these are my top two picks for my Fossil collections. They roughly cost about 150 bucks per watch and their design are just classic. You can dress it up or dress it down, perfect for night outs or any special occasions. Also, I'm a big fan of watches with mesh type straps, such as this one I'm wearing right now. Uh, I got this from Paul Rich. They are very light with very slick look and very modern look. I love how I can adjust the strap without removing any chain links compared to a watch like this. Another watch out there that often overlooked as our digital watches. This would cost you roughly about 30, 40 bucks. Unfortunately, a lot of men out there often wear watches like this one going to work or something like this and they end up ruining their watches simply because they're working in a rough environment. Uh, personally, I always wear a watch like this pretty much on a daily basis or depending on what kind of work I'll be doing. It's just that I don't want to ruin my nice watches such as this one or this one uh, going to work so something like this works really well for me uh, this one I got from uh, Casio it's a, I think it's about 30 40 bucks and it's very rugged very durable so that just gives you that nice uh, flexibility so definitely one of the watches you could consider is a digital watch also last one I have here are bracelets uh, what I noticed lately is that not a lot of men out there wear bracelets anymore and that's kind of sad because I'm a big fan of them since it can give me that nice rugged look and I combine them all together and wear it with my watch. I got these bracelets from a company called RGNB, uh, Rose Gold and Black which is based from Australia. They promote accessories with contemporary look using rose gold and black color. I love their styling uh, simply because they give me that nice rugged look and of course more. And these bracelets uh, cost roughly about 30 uh, bucks or more depending on uh, the style that you go for. So what I would normally do is I would wear them along with my watch on the other side of my wrist and go from something like this. Yeah, and so I would wear it like that. And I love them. Like I said, it gives me that nice rugged look along with a watch like this from Paul Rich and by the way this is about a hundred bucks uh, or might be less now depending on if it's on sale so there you have it guys I hope you like my video about holiday gift ideas and that I was able to help you out with your quest in finding the great gifts for your loved ones if you have any questions about these products send me a message on YouTube and I'll be more than happy to reply also uh, if you don't mind uh, please help me grow my channel by subscribing to my channel to receive free new video updates and yes, thank you for watching. Have a good day. Bye.